Well, good day, everyone. Hello, Bart. How are you today? Yes, swinging an axe. <laughs> yeah, very good. As you can see, uh, we, we're back in the city again today. Uh, we're going to be developing a underwater fortress of our very own. Um, the weird thing is, is the reason why I'm developing my own underwater fortress is basically because I couldn't find it in my own world. Uh, you know, the actual temple. And uh, as you can see, our last creation uh, is all the way over there. Uh, not the house that I built, you know, the big city with the uh, green thing on top. So... Anyway, and uh, this is the rest of the city now, so as you can tell, <laughs> I've been, uh, it, it's still it's still very much unfinished. So what I've done here is, as you can see, I've got a whole bunch of uh, burners going here. Um, I've, uh, I've been building some, uh, well, building, making some uh, glass. Uh, so basically, uh, you know, like we're going to construct the whole entire thing out of glass. So I'm just going to grab as much as it's made already. Uh, so, yeah. So I've got like... Uh, if I just get like three lots of 64, uh, and possibly whatever's left over, so that should be enough, uh, just to get us started anyway. So all I'm going to do here, uh, we're going to start building it around here. Now then, there's going to be two ways that I'm going to do this, um, that I'm going to check. I might end up doing two separate videos, but um, what I've done before, like that big giant mountain thing over there, I don't know if you can see it, I actually ended up carving that whole thing out of the mountain. It took so long to do uh, and really I could have just built it from fresh really um, you know so but so I'm gonna explore two different avenues uh, today so what we're gonna do first we're gonna build one on a flat ground out of str uh, you know like um, just on a stretch and uh, oops I need to start my night vision potion where's my night vision now oh, there it is so I need to drink that as well oops. This is it. there we go so now if I just jump in this water here so as we can see, we've got plenty of flat ground. We've got plenty of uh, lumpy ground, as I like to call it. Now, what, a, what you could do is start on a flat piece, uh, you know, somewhere around here. And uh, then uh, you could maybe, I don't know, like uh, carve one out of the mountain. So anyway, this underwater temple uh, that I'm building is just going to be sort of like, um, it's going to be sort of like, you know, it's, it's going to be one and then there's going to be another one nearby. And I might even do like an underwater rail system. Uh, so yeah, I mean either way, it's uh, I, th I think it's I think it's gonna be okay. So here we here we go. There's a there's a flat piece of ground right here. So, yep. And uh, the funny thing is is that the Minec Minecraft is just updated. So I would laugh my head off if after I've, after I build this thing, that uh, you know this this uh, this whole underwater temple thing actually appears to me. Uh, so yeah. <laughs> So either way, uh, so we've got the eight minute po night vision potion and, uh, and whatever, I've just wasted nearly two minutes. So, so let's just, let's start, shall we? So let's uh, just load up all our glass here. So, yeah, luckily I have, I have reserves, uh, so that should be okay. But the idea is, is to try and get so much done that I don't need to waste it all again. So, so here we go. So we need to figure out how wide we're going to make it. So let's start. So let's say... Let's see, it's going to be like 15, something like that. So, one, two, three, what? Four, whoa, how many is that? One, two, three, four, five, okay. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. All right. Let's do it 15 wide as well. One, two, three, four. Hmm, what's half of 15? So, it's yeah, okay, so seven and a half. So, okay, so we're going to go one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So as you can see, we've sort of got ourselves a bit of a doorway going here. So we should have two, four, six, seven on this side, and two, four, six only on that side. All right, no, no worries. Let's just make it a. Hmm. If I'm going to make this symmetrical, I might, I might have to. Uh, because if I am going to build a rail system, so I might have to make this uh, just slightly longer, slightly wider uh, on this side. So anyway, so now we have uh, like two, four, six, eight on this side. And we have two, four, six, seven. So yeah, we'll just need to lose one of these. Yep. So there we go. So now I can put the rail system in the middle and uh, that should be good. So all right then. So um, and what we're going to do here, we're just going to get this... Uh, Chiseled sandstone. Ah, that's what I was meant to do. Never mind. What another waste of glass. So we're gonna have like a like a temple entrance here with the chiseled sandstone. OK, 
okay, just like that. And maybe, the good thing about this, you know, like if, if you fall down, it doesn't matter because, uh, you know, you're underwater, so. All right then, so that's our entrance. So now we just need to build this back up again. It's gonna get rid of that one. And uh, we're gonna need to, uh, yeah, again, I've just wasted, I've just wasted glass again. So one, two, three, four, okay. One, two, three, four. Okay. And I can't close that up yet because I need some more. So, <laughs> never mind. So, as you can see, we've uh, got the pretty much uh, the base uh, already done. Uh, so, what we're going to do here, as you can see, we're uh, constructing the roof, uh, making it like a, like a pyramid sort of shape. And, uh, oops, as you can see, I'm about to run out of glass. Oof. Right. Can I place this chest here? Well, it's not a chest, really. So, it's... All right. Let's see if I can place this. Oh, and I can, look at that. How about that? Uh, I had to go uh, source out some more night vision potions. So this is currently my fourth glass of night vision potion. <laughs> so as you can see, we've got plenty of water breathing. So I'm hoping that once uh, once I've actually got the whole thing done, then I don't actually need to have uh, so much, you know, night vision uh, until the next time. Uh, so the idea is, is that to make plenty of light in this building uh, so that I don't have to do this all the time, if you know what I mean. So. Anyway, so what we're going to do here is we're just going to finish off this roof. Now then, the next issue is going to be getting the water out of the temple. And last but not least, we have the top, the last three. So there we go. Now then, if we just take a, a step back or a, or a swim back, we can sort of do a swim by of what the place looks like now. Uh, I need to create some more uh, chiseled sandstone for that top bit there, so, uh, but that's not a problem. So if I just enter this building now. It's here. Will a furnace work or will it not work? Haha! <laughs> I wonder. Did, will it actually cook something? Let's try it. Let's try it. Let's put some sun in here. Oh my god, it actually works! Underwater! Haha! <laughs> nice! So what we're really doing here is just creating like an underwater tunnel system. Uh, yep. Yeah. Like so. Okay. There we go. So if I just place these here, like so. And then if I get my stone pickaxe, oops, <laughs> that wasn't a good idea. So if I just replace that there, there we go. Now I have plenty of room to breathe. <laughs> Now the idea is, is I need to keep repeating that. Um, so uh, we finally got the uh, water out. Uh, as you can tell, I've run out of, uh, God, it took me so much night vision just to do this. And all I've got left is a bit of water breathing, um, which I didn't actually need that in the end. So uh, it wasn't that bad. So what I ended up having to do was just constructed and then fill the whole thing full of dirt which sort of defeats the object really <laughs> um because draining the thing uh, just took me so long to do so anyway so i'm just getting down to the end of it now uh, we need to figure out what we're going to do for the floor uh... <coughs> and there we go so let's just add a bit more light in here there we go some light there some light there, some light there, light there, light there. Okay, so we can get rid of that. Some light there. So we have ourselves our own underwater temple. As you can see over here, I've just bricked these up temporarily because obviously, if I uh, 
fight do that, then all hell breaks loose, <laughs> or all water breaks loose, either, either way you look at it, so. Um, oh, well I've replaced that with some glass, so I don't mind, that's alright. Anyway, so I am going to have to figure out how I'm going to get out of here. No matter which way I turn, his eyes keep following me. Oh, I am Bart Simpson. You must obey me. Hey, Bart. Hey, Johnny. Completely different. Now then, if I sort of look out the window here, the port side window, we have a bit of a rock over there. Uh, what we're actually doing, we're going to see which one takes the least amount of time building around the same size. Uh, now then, before I do that, I'd just like to pick your brains about something. You know, like, uh, no, we're... I'm not going to turn you into a zombie or anything like that. I can put that nether wart in there because uh, eventually, when I do eventually find some uh, iron, I can create another uh, brewing stand. And <laughs> you know, so yeah. And uh, oh, while we're here, let's just uh, put some more of these here. I think I'm going to need. I think I'm going to need quite a few of these. I think so. We'll we'll, we'll see anyway. So I'll just put the rest of these in there. Or maybe I should just keep all of it. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, because it's. I think we're going to need some more glass. So let's just uh, create some more. Uh, Sand there. Yep, let's just do this. Okay. Anyway, the thing I wanted to pick your brain about was uh, I was thinking that, you know, like eventually when, uh, you know, when it comes in like this, the, the rail's going to come in like this. It's probably going to stop right around here in the middle. Uh, so I've got some quartz here. Now then, see what you think about this. Here we go, what do you think of that? And then the and then the train will sort of come along here. Again, I have set both of these two eight minutes long again, so so we're just gonna escape out this little airlock here. Come on. Right. Now then back over here, uh, back over that way, this is the city. I think. We'll just double check that. Yep, alright, so we're heading more outland. So just take another swim by. <laughs> oh, swim by. I make myself laugh sometimes. I really do, you know. And, uh, oh. The funny thing is, is this particular one right here isn't actually that far away. So maybe I should really have thought about this. Or maybe I should just pick another one. Oh, well. Or maybe I could use it. You know what? What, what the hell? You know. Start. So it's going to be like, uh, let's avoid that clay because I might want it to. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. So 15 this way, like the other one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, uh, 6, and 7, I believe it was, before we made the entrance. So like the last one, we're going to put that there and one there. So pretty much I'm just going to keep going around this uh, until I've finished it and then we can get started on uh, on this right here. So, hmm. so uh, as you can see I've been a bit busy. Um, I've just pretty much been playing around with uh, with it. I mean I've got some carrots growing here um, and uh, I, d I wonder I wonder what else grows down here. Uh, I don't seem to think I have anything else. Um, you know, other than carrots. <laughs> so maybe some trees will grow down here or something. Anyway, so I've finished doing this particular part. I need to get rid of those up there. Um, anyway, the the answer, the short answer really to, uh, you know, to, to which way is easier. Um, there isn't really a short answer because they're both just as hard. Because either way, you've still, I mean, this particular one here, I built, um, I built from scratch, you know, on a flat piece of, uh, flat piece of seabed. Whereas this one over here, I built mainly out of a out of a temple, uh, out of a temple, out of a mountain, um, well, a like, tiny mountain, and um, it was so much, still so much, so much of a pain because I still had to, you know, like uh, I had to dig through it all, you know, and uh, uh, so I actually think that even though this is actually bigger, I actually thought that this particular one was actually a bit harder. So anyway, yeah. So um, obviously, I've got all these ready here for uh, for when I'm. Uh, <laughs> as you can see, I've, when I'm ready to make another, uh, make another, I don't know, temple or whatever out here. So, uh, yeah. So, so that's pretty much it. 
as you can see, I've also done this walkway uh, in between uh, in between both of them. And um, yeah, I mean, I mean, if I just jump out the airlock here, so let's just uh, get up here and have a quick look at this. So it actually looks pretty good. <laughs> So anyway, so so this was my uh, underwater temple, and uh, it looks great from uh, from up here. If I just get in, get in a boat here, so there we go. So let's just do a quick swim by. <laughs> yeah, it uh, it doesn't look so bad. It it looks all right, you know. And uh, it took a while to do. I don't think I'll be doing another one, uh, not for a while. So, but anyway, it's it's something different. And I know it doesn't look very symmetrical or anything like this, um, but it's okay you know it's all right <laughs> it's an underwater temple you know so all right so anyway so oh bart in a boat huh bart's looking at me <laughs> so anyway so uh from um oh do you know that would make a pretty cool snapshot actually <laughs> yeah with bart's face and everything in it so anyway so what we're gonna do now is uh we're gonna say uh good night um um so my name is johnny i was playing as bart simpson so from me, ciao for now. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Next week we'll be over in the jungle and I will be building a really, really huge tree house. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, I actually said I was going to do this in the neighborhood, but either way, I thought it'd be more fitting in the jungle. So, either way, so uh, it's going to be uh, pretty good. It's going to be really, really tall. Um, and uh, we can look down at all the other jungle trees and all the animals and, and everything. And... Uh, so yeah, so tune in next week, and uh, I'll see you then. Ciao for now.